Okay, so welcome for this reading session. My name is Sergio Vargas, and the topic of, of this session is the worst jobs in the world. And the idea in this class is to work about this topic, this different exercise to improve the vocabulary and reading comprehension and in general the reading skill so for first we're gonna do a warming up completed these eight sentence with the words here and to improve the comprehension in the students with this type of context so continue with that we have to read one exercise with three different paragraphs to match these three different paragraphs with the image here right and for the last part we have to con to to complete our reading time our reading exercise the final reading about job and professions so we have this reading talking about some professions in the world and the students have to read this this long text to check uh, their abilities with the reading skill and improve it knowing a new vocabulary and the pronunciation of new words so move on on the text the idea is to solve or sort out, sort out this exercise so my brother in i'm gonna read the the exercise with the correct answer so the first my brother has left the school and he's looking for a job he's like to work in a hotel number two I notice an advertisement for an interesting job in the newspaper. Number three, I sent, it, I sent in an application for a holiday job at a fast food restaurant. Number four, they, uh, they offered my mom a job in a department store, but she decided not to take it. Number five. My sister joined uh, a team of programmers who work on a video games. Number six, my brother has a degree in engineering from Cambridge University. Number seven, during the summer holidays, I work at a theme park and had the work of selling ice cream. And number eight, Joe took the day off work so that he could visit his mom who is ill. That's the response of this exercise. So let's continue with the reading. So we have to read the text to match with the correct picture. So this is the three pictures. Let's gonna check the different texts. So the first text, Jeff Haslam spends a lot of his time underground. He works in London sweaters. The tunnels under the roads that carry away waste water and other much dirtier things. His job is to keep the sweaters clean. We work in team of six says Jeff it's very dirty work and of course we work in the dark he has to wear special clothes a mask and a helmet with the light the most difficult thing is clearing the fat of oil from the sweaters under the Chinese and Indian restaurants he says last month we removed 1000 tons of fat let's continue with the letter B Many people like to work outdoors, but f 
but few would like Charlie's da Charlie's Radley's job. Charlie lives in Alaska and works on a fishing boat. Each fishing trip lasts about a week. It's extremely cold and often stormy, says Charlie. So we wear warm, waterproof clothes. Charlie can earn a lot of money if they catch a lot of fish, but if, if they don't, he earns very little. I'll do this job for a year or two more, says Charlie. Then I'm going to look for another job, something warmer and drier. Let's continue with the door C. Sandy Smith is a lumberjack, somebody who cuts down trees. Sandy noticed an advertisement for lumberjacks on the internet. Lumberjacks work long hours and are not very well paid, but as Sandy likes to work outdoors, she decided to apply for the job. It's a very dangerous job, says Sandy. We work with big, dangerous machines and we're always a long way from the nearest hospital. So I always very careful. So taking account these these short stories, these paragraphs, these descriptions, we have to match these paragraphs with the correct picture. So the picture the picture one uh, corresponds to the description in the paragraph A. Number two with the number the letter C and number three the men the men fishing the fishing men uh, corresponds to the letter B. So that that's the exercise. And for the, for the final part we're gonna do the job and professions exercise, right? So let's gonna read this this part. As has been the case for many years, jobs or forms of employment wherein employees perform a service or duty in exchange for financial compensation play a prominent role in a society. Furthermore, all jobs, even those of C singly, little significance are important as they as they simply wouldn't exist if their specific responsibilities weren't of value to employers, companies of persons that pay off others for their work, and customers, individuals who pay money for a product or service, and the economy in general. Teachers or educational professionals tasked with helping students understand certain subjects and topics are especially crucial today. In short, teachers help their students to become qualified for their, for their future careers. Doctors or medical professionals who specialize in providing health-related assistance to patients are some of the most respected indivi individuals in America and the world. It's the responsibility of doctors to help those who fell less than stellar to determine the underlying health issues and recommend an effective treatment or remedy to a, a dis disease, disorder or condition. There are there are quite a few types of especially doctors in America, besides MD, which simply means medical doctor, all of whom can be referred that simply as doctor name. Dentists, mouth teeth doctors, dermatologists, skin doctors, and psychiatrists, mental health doctors, are just a few examples of many different types of doctors. Additionally, nurses are medical professionals who help to administer doctor ordered treatments to patients. Police officers are law enforcement professionals whose job it is to protect citizens, 
solve crimes, and assure the rules and regulations are followed. Similarly, firefighters serve the public by responding to fires and other emer emergency situations, and using high-tech equipment to extinguish these fires, while bringing any individuals who are in danger to safety. Farmers maintain fields of crops, of vegetables, fruit plants, and or collections of animals with the intention of selling these products as food. Chefs or cooks prepare meals in professional settings including restaurants, cafeterias, and other venues where food and drink are sold for customers. Chefs are generally experienced in cooking and managing kitchens. Waiters bring menus, um, beverage, meals, and ultimately the check or a bill of the foods and drinks purchased in a transaction to tables in restaurants and other establishments to serve food. Artists produce art or works of creative significance including music, paintings, drawings, poetry, writing, and more. And that's it. This is the reading of the final part. And the idea is the students read all these texts and ask me uh, for their different dubs of the vocabulary, the meaning of some words, of even the pronunciation. So, uh, I'm gonna sort out the final question or dubs for my students in this class, and finally, with all question re uh, results, uh, I'm gonna send to my students the link for the attendance and that's it this is all for the class thank you so much see you in the next time